Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of The Rise of the Ronin. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we're going to do some side questing. A Thousand Blades is going to be our first side quest. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Hmm. You look like you have some skill. I have a favor to ask of you. A hulking man calling himself Benke has been appearing on Gojo Bridge at night. He attacks every samurai he sees and claims the arms and armor of those he's beaten. Let me guess, you're someone he's beaten? Did you have to say it out loud? My reputation would suffer if this were to become public knowledge. That's why I'm seeking help in a place like this. If you can defeat that man and recover my possessions, you'll be well rewarded. What does this man look like? He appears on Gojo Bridge every night and announces himself loudly. You'll recognize him the instant you see him. Sure, I suppose I can help you out. Excellent. Now I'd thank you to see to it promptly. Just take care to be discreet. Don't breathe a word of this to a single soul or bring anyone with you. All those who are distant, give me ear! All those who are nigh, bear witness. Benke is my name. Come! Who dares to battle with me? I dare do. You dare, champion! Oh. Take us! That wasn't too bad. Uh, this done. I thank thee, brave champion. <clears throat> to the same, I acted somewhat rashly, and yet I regret that thing. Just trying to see what all I got for doing that. 
missions. Now we need to do some bond missions. Well, one, because we still can't do the Midnight Revenge. So let's fast travel over to the Choshu clan. Inside here. It's you. Hello there. Everyone still at a bit of a loss after what happened with Genzui. Now we're allied with the Satsuma. The time is ripe. I need to pull myself together. Speaking of the Satsuma, one of their men demanded a duel some time ago. It was quite a while back. Do you remember? I do. I was actually surprised by how well you fought. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. That means a lot coming from you. Katsura, there's just no way we can ascend to this. You want us to join forces with those who drove Kusaka to his death? I assure you, it pains me too. I didn't expect you to come around to the idea just like that. Which is why I prepared a banquet for us with the Satsuma. On their end, Okubo will take the lead. Kuroda's lot will be attending too. It'll be a good chance to see if they're worthy of our trust. Don't you think? Very well then. I shall take the measure of the Satsuma and decide for myself. If possible, I'd like you to attend as well. What do you say? Absolutely. I'll come along. Good. I've made arrangements at the place nearby. Come by later. Right. Let's go. Oh, Kubo of the Satsuma is running late, it seems. However, I did see the man who sent me that letter. This is a hot blooded gathering. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see how this unfolds. <laughs> Sorry for the wait. Let's begin, shall we? <laughs> Katsura, remember that jewel we had? I have to say, I was rather disappointed at the time. You had no clue who I was, but let me go free. Too soft for a samurai. And now we are to stand shoulder to shoulder. We Satsuma despair. You're a fool! Katsura sees further into the future than either of us. If he let you go free, he had a good reason. Katsura ended up figuring out who you were in the end. <laughs> it didn't really take much. And that's why you let me go. Because you were afraid of earning the ire of the Satsuma. Utter cowardice. You there. Yamagata, was it? If you dislike what we have to say, come and silence us with your fists. Perhaps then I'll reconsider. I'd be only too delighted. I don't need a weapon to take down the likes of you. You'll soon regret disrespecting Kasura and the Choshu. Hey, cut it out! I don't think there's any stopping this now. I swear if Okubo has my head for this. Don't worry. Just let them have at it. Kusaka Katsura! Brave and believe what you do! Remains unshakable! One wrong move is all it takes for a horse to come crashing down! You should know this! 
Maintain a certain standard, how can I expect anyone to follow me? <laughs> I thought you were all talk, but you're not bad. I, too, underestimated your strength. Katsura, I ask you, forgive my rudeness just now. <laughs> Sobering up, are we? I am glad you put on this feast. It was worth it just to see that tussle. Overthrowing the Shogunate won't be the end of it. We'll need good, reasonable men like Katsura here to right the course of our nation. Thank you, everyone. Now, let's get back to enjoying the feast! My apologies for dragging you along to this, but I have to say, seeing you fight never fails to impress. In fact, that particular display made me want to try my luck. Why not go around with me? I'll be waiting out back for you. Right, let's begin. I like to think I know your abilities better than anyone. That's to say, I won't hold back. Ow. Damn. It's very hard to read. Nakamura said that I'm too soft, and I am. This I know full well. Damn it. Now I'm on fire. <laughs> That's rather impressive, you know. Good. <laughs> I'm starting to warm up. That's the way. So, I'll never stop walking our path. Do you hear me, Kusaka? That fight was tough. Nakamura, and I see Okubo has finally arrived. Hmm. I see from that jewel you aren't as soft as I thought. Your resolve is clear for all to see. Did you plan this little display from the start? Of course not. I just fancied brushing up on my sword play. I'm delighted you enjoyed what you saw. Regardless. A likely story. <laughs> well, as your partner in this alliance, I liked what I saw. I warn you, I intend to rely on your sword arm. <sighs> I can't believe Okubo and the others were watching. <sighs> Thanks to that unexpected audience, it seems the alliance will hold a little longer. The nights worked out beautifully, thanks to you. Though it was hard to ignore Nakamura's provocations at first. 
Honestly, I have my own doubts about whether doing things my way will really be able to change Japan. I do have a vision, and everyone's been good enough to follow me. But behind closed doors, I worry all the time. What's your opinion? Am I doing things the right way? I believe in your methods. Thank you. If that's what you think, I have nothing to fear. See how that katana looks? Nope. I'm going to go with the main mission. Yeah, I mean, we can't really do anything else. So let's go over here. Which way are we going? Start this main mission. The end of the Shogunate. I'm over here. You came. We'll begin once Ito's men are here. This is your first official mission. Is there anything you need to ask? Where's Nagakura? I haven't mentioned this to him. He suspects I've been making moves in secret. There are plots everywhere. Wheels within wheels. I'll tell you everything if we make it through this. Is Toto coming? He should be here any moment. Not as our ally, but as our enemy. Todo and Suzuki are part of Ito's faction. Good men, both of them. But we have no choice. Well, I guess I don't have any further questions. Good. That saves me some trouble. Todo and his companions are masters of the sword. This will be quite the fight. Are you fully prepared? I sure am. Good. We'll ambush them as they return. I stand at the ready. Let's begin then. Ah. They're coming. Quickly, hide. I am hiding. I don't see them, though. Oh, I see them now. Oh! <laughs> 
so it come to this. Just as it all had feared it would. The deception has gone both ways. Don't take it personally. And now. <laughs> Kondor thinks only of winning glory in battle. And a door. We can strive for a world free of conflict and bloodshed. Jesus. He is. He hits hard, man. Find him. Maybe we gotta go up this way. up there. Thank you. Okay, I don't think we're going the right way. Maybe we need to go around this other way. Suzuki is here too. He'll fight like a madman to protect his brother. Rather than face him head on. Perhaps we should strike from the roof. I agree. Oh, there's a guy right here. to my brother get him my brother will lead Japan to a brighter future no one must get in his way no, oh, I got rid of it on accident. I have failed you, brother. Anything else over here? Maybe something behind here? Nope.
I can see you're a natural. Prepare yourself! Well, I see that going a little better, but I should have known better. Nice treasure chest over here. Think you outwitted me, do you? Ha! It's you who has been cornered. <laughs> Don't fool yourself. Grow too and for your own good. In the name of Captain Condor, I will mete out your punishment. I thought you had some sense. It seems I was wrong. Of the past. Holy shit. for your own good. It made you think all those around you were fools. Which is why you couldn't bear to serve on the Kondo. So earnestly devoted to the Shogunate. I'm lucky I had you covering my flank. With that, we've excised a cancer from the Shinsengumi. I don't know who you are, but it's time to stop pretending you're one of us. When did you realize? I've seen more than my fair share of plots and schemes. I just had a feeling. See you around.
Oh, I need to raise the bond with Kondo. Oh, no. Yeah, he's got cholera. Ah, oh, it's you. Quite a pathetic sight, aren't I? I don't want to wither away when I've done. If I'm going to die, I want to burn like a firework, but it seems that's too much to ask. Tuberculosis. It's already ravaged much of his lungs. I'm afraid he's too far gone. Isn't there anything we can do for him? I've already done everything I could. Damn it all. Tsukasuki can't leave us so soon. It's not yet his time. There's been a talk of a samurai researching a cure for tuberculosis. Rumor has it he's had a breakthrough. They say he's hidden himself away in a hut on the mountain's northeastern suburbs. If you can smoke him out, he might be able to help. Then let's go find him. Just to be clear, even the Westerners haven't found the cure for tuberculosis. You'd be a fool to get your hopes up. If there's even a sliver of hope, then we have to try, don't we? I'll make my way to the mountain at once. Meet me there, all right? So he's got tuberculosis and not cholera. Even worse. I've spoken with the locals and gotten an idea. The hut of the samurai in question ought to be halfway up this mountain. We need to get that medicine for Takasuki no matter what. Come on, let's go. Let's hurry. Oh, I should mention that some suspicious samurai were seen heading up the mountain not long ago. We'll want to stay vigilant as we go. But why is this samurai holed up in a hut in the mountains? It must have some reason. Barbarian loving scum, prepare yeah. to be cut oh, down! Yeah. Enough! <laughs> what crime oh. have I committed? <laughs> 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 You ah, oh, thank you. What a nice surprise. Isn't it? What brings you all the way out here? I heard talk of a samurai looking for a cure to tuberculosis. You wouldn't happen to be the man I'm looking for. Guilty as charged. At least, I don't know of anyone else who fits the description. 
Why are you doing research out here? The soil and the plants here are useful for my work. And being somewhere this remote discourages interruptions. What kind of interruptions? Well, like the one you just saw, for starters. I've had an increasing number of boisterous visitors of late. Die, barbarian-loving traitor, shogunate scum. That's typically the way it goes. If you found a cure, can you share it with us, please? You have to help us. Someone's life depends on it. I see. So that's why you sought me out. Very well. I've formulated something that might be able to help. But it's further down the road and there might be more interruptions. Might I ask you to be my escort? Absolutely. Oh, good. I'm not really one for slashing and stabbing. Shall we be off? Fukuzo, meet your retribution. Fucking hate those guys, man. Take a moment. I trust you remember the links we went to acquiring that soil from the bamboo trees. After much trial and error, I finally succeeded in turning that soil into this. I should say, I don't know for certain that the medicine works. For all I know, it might make your friend worse. Are you sure you want it? I'm sure. I see. You don't have the luxury of time. Very well then. This is yours. What else can we do? If there's any hope at all that this works, we can't afford to hesitate. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm heading back first to tell Zakaski. I'm not sure who it is you're trying to save, but I hope they recover soon. Out of my way! I have to leave! Out of my way! I've got a thousand things to do. You won't achieve immortality if you die now. No, I won't. But to hell with waiting for death to come take me. Even now, our comrades are fighting to bring down the Shogunate, shedding blood 
for our cause. While they risk life and them, I can't, I won't lie useless in bed. I have some medicine. You don't need to hurry to your grave. Nonsense. There's no cure for tuberculosis. Now, get out of my way. I'm warning you. I won't hold back. As a matter of fact, I wouldn't mind going together with you. Let's do this! <laughs> <laughs> No, almost died there. I can't move. That? Let me choose a suitable place to die. I'm of no use to the Kihetai in my current state. Fine. I won't fight this anymore. I'd be lying if I said I had no regrets. But I will go quietly and leave our mission to the rest of you. Remember, if you're going to die, you have to burn bright like a firework first. <laughs> if only. But if you have some grand idea, then I'm more years. Well, you're not going to die. I have some medicine for you. Take it. Medicine. That will never work. I just can't win with you. Fine. So I'm supposed to drink this then? It's amazing that you're already up and about, Sakasuki. Amazing is right. I can't tell if I should be more shocked or impressed. While I suspect the drug has had some effect, I dare say you were saved by your sheer will to live, or your stubborn refusal to walk through death's door. <laughs> I'm still kicking thanks to you all. Now I just need to decide. How to use my newfound vitality. Take your time and think about it. I will. For a while I thought my future would be cut short. But now I have a little room to breathe. 
If life should grant greater opportunity, then life is the way forward. With the life I've been granted, I will finish the task of overturning the shogunate. Then I will look upon a new Japan with my own eyes. Whatever the future might bring, I cannot wait to see. Well, we can't do that one yet. Where is he normally at? We can check our bonds real quick. We're looking for Kondo. Must have passed him somewhere. Why do I not see him? Okay, so he's over by the temple. Yeah, right here. Let's try to give him some stuff, see if we can't do his quest real quick. We might have enough time just to do his side quest, or his bond quest, whatever you want to call it. He's in here. So you came. Ah! Something wrong? No, I just have some stuff for you. You've got passable taste. Ah. Oh, oh, he disappeared. <laughs> Must have, uh, yeah. Cool. That was easy. Let's talk to him, do this bond mission, and then we'll end the video uh, right after. Ah, it's you. Some news. We confirmed that the gang from the other day was indeed connected to Serizawa. That's not all. Nagakura and Todo did some digging. And ran the Tarauri Sumo Restras was Serizawa's people as well. Ah. Serizawa told us we were of the same mind when it came to serving the Shogun. He bolstered the Shinsengumi's forces with his many connections. In him, I thought we'd found an ally we could depend on. <sighs> but his acts of extortion and drunken debauchery have simply gone too far. We can no longer leave Kamo Serizawa unchecked. He and his men shall be put to death. Then let's get it done. Lord Katamori has already approved of our decision. It is now up to us to see the act through. This will be bloody. Serizawa's people are skilled. I hope you will fight on our side. I will. Good. With your help, there's no way we can fail. We already know where to find them. They're having a meal at one of their regular haunts. Then that's where we'll go. Come. This way. I thought we were comrades, and so I let him go unpunished. But that man has gone too far! Mm, 
Those are Seri's hours, Rakis. Does a cautious of him to post the picket at the back? Oh, I'm surprised. I thought you men were Shinzen Gumi soldiers. Have you no sense of pride? Yeah, we're going to have a boss fight for sure. See how hard this boss fight is. I was hoping we might get a chance to close bridge. Now that you turn your back on the way of the samurai, I can't let you live. I will send you to the hereafter, along with your dusty old dreams! You did what a leader must. It was only right for you to kill those who studied the Shinsengumi's name. There is no going back. Any samurai who disgraces our way of life will suffer the bloody consequences. How can there be justice otherwise? I don't care what changes sweep through our society. I am a samurai. And I shall protect what that entails. And thus, the Shinsengumi shall follow. In the world we live in, you may have to exchange blows with your former comrades someday. Prepare yourself for when that time comes. I've already been prepared for that as long as I can remember. <laughs> of course you have. 
Don't know what I was thinking, reminding you of all people. There are times you'll have to dispense with your emotions to stay true to the life you've chosen. That's just the nature of the world we live in. We've taken care of Kamo Serizawa and his followers, Lord Katamori. Hmm. <laughs> Splendid. You have done what a good leader must, Kondo. I am pleased. Thank you for the gracious compliment, sir. The Shinzungumi will only grow more important in the days to come. I hope I can count on your continued dedication to serving your shogunate and country. Yes, sir! As you heard, the Shin Sengumi will continue to uphold the true meaning of what it is to be samurai. But I am under no illusion that things will always be this way. I am an old-fashioned man. There will come a time when my way of thinking is obsolete. Should that time come, I hope you too will still wear the Shin Sengumi name with pride. Even that would be of great comfort to me. <laughs> A useless train of thought. You are in no danger of becoming obsolete as long as I am around. <laughs> You're a reliable one, Toshi. Please, just remember. I would gladly die for what I believe in, but I have no intention of taking either of you with me. I realize it's not my place to ask you this, but if anything were to happen to me, I hope you will be there for Toshi and Soji. I'll keep that in mind. Ah, thank you. You have lifted a weight off my shoulders. None of this would have been possible without you. I have no doubt that we will need your help in the future. Toshi and Soji are like little brothers to me. You are like a friend beyond compare. I know it may not be what you want to hear, but I am speaking my truth. I hope you'll Help us again if we need you. Thank you. So I think right here is where we're going to end the video today, everybody. I want to start by telling you all thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. It really does mean the world to me. Hopefully, hopefully you all enjoyed the video. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.